It's the DK and DK show. Please stand by. Please stand by. On the air next. Please stand by. It's all about the internet. www.pknDK.com. Forget the PK and DK, DK show. show. Your average everyday couple fight and make up on YouTube. Welcome to our dysfunctional life. <laughs> Everybody joining us live, 7 p.m. sharp. <laughs> this is the start time. Uh, My name is Pika. That is Denise Lowe. Hello, hello. Happy Saturday. I know. Wow. We're doing this on a Saturday. That's what crazy. What is going on? I got nervous today for some reason. I'm sure a lot of you are going to be checking out the replay so shout out to the replay gang 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 gang, 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 gang. Uh, shout out to everybody that's uh joining us live whether it's now or uh throughout the show uh game night i've got some games game that we're night. gonna play i got some new things that we're gonna try out i'm pretty excited about it that's on the way we got uh i've got uh, what's that noise yeah still trying to get a winner for that you're on your phone what's happening over there yeah i'm just checking everybody out because like i got donations that are already, already? like dropping in what the heck that is right that's what i'm talking about <laughs> yeah. yes. Oh! <laughs> oh yeah, now from we turn up tonight. Yeah, I was like, from we ain't gotta wake up tomorrow. I mean, we we do. It's it, it's, it's a holiday for a lot of people. <laughs> yes, it is. I'm not very religious. Clearly, my bad. Yeah, this is the uh, this is uh, he already came out of the cave, or is he coming out of the cave? Oh my goodness, it's Easter Sunday. Okay. Oh, okay. That's <laughs> everybody knows that. Give me some more details. I don't have any more. Oh, no, you don't we're, make fun of me if you don't even know the rest of the details. Where are the bunnies? Yeah. <laughs> Happy Easter to all that celebrate. Happy Easter to you guys. <laughs> How is everybody doing? I've been dropping out a few plus shows, and I asked that question on the plus show. I was, you know, like, I want to know from you. How the hell are you doing? And instant voice notes actually started coming in. Angie asked, what's new with us? I gained a daughter-in-law. My son got married last weekend in Buckhead, and it was a magical weekend. Her parents put on the best wedding and reception I've ever been to. So now I have a new daughter-in-law by the name of Dina. Yay! Bye! There you go. Bye! Bye! We haven't done that in a while, you know? I haven't done that in a while. Congratulations. Also, uh, I got, uh, I, I know, I, I'm kind of disappointed in the uh, the chat that's joining us live right now because nobody has mentioned my hair. Oh, your hair? Fleek. Cut. Look at this. Come on. Do I need to take the headphones off? Uh-huh. Looking smooth. What but... about me? What about me? Oh, yeah, you got yours done today. Yeah, you called me what? Like two-toned? Uh, Is that what no, you told I said me? split toning because I've been doing <laughs> some uh, some color correcting uh, stuff. Oh. I didn't realize that you were going to get offended by that. We'll, we'll come back to that. But the reason that I brought up my hair uh, cut uh, is because the 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 guy that was cutting my hair was telling me somehow it came out that uh, because it's Easter. Yeah, they're gonna ha they're gonna all get together. And it's a big family. Of He's course, like, I got a lot of brothers and sisters. And I'm yeah. like, how many brothers and sisters, right? And I dropped this on the plus show. His mom uh, uh, popped out twelve kids. 12 kids that how do you do that, that i'm not insane. talking about like physically i'm talking about like even like what's your every what's what's an average day in a house where you're raising 12 children yeah this, do you have help <laughs> like i mean i would assume that like half of the kids by that point they're almost <laughs> adults right like that's a that's a lot of kids so i asked you uh you know if you personally do you know somebody that popped out a lot of kids i think i phrased it probably better yeah um but check this out Good morning, PK and Denise. I sure am glad you posted a little quick clip. I sure miss hearing your voice, and I miss Denise, too. Thought I'd call in on the number of kids. So my mother was the oldest of 10. There were seven girls, three boys, and when I was born, they lived in a little four-bedroom townhouse. 
So the three boys got one room and the parents got the other room and then the seven girls had to split it between two rooms. Um, so when I was born, my mother's youngest baby brother was only three years older than me. So we kind of grew up as cousins. And yes, it was a religious thing for them. They mm. were Catholic. And at the time, Catholics were not allowed to use birth control. Mm. And she actually had had three other do the pregnancies, jacks. but those miscarried. Miss you guys. <laughs> love you. Bye. Yeah, so you don't get pregnant. Bye. You do the jumping jacks. Oh, oh. Oh, that's yeah, not that's how all. It that's birth control. That goes back to the caveman era. That does not that's work science. that way. No, yeah, it, up and down, stuff falls out. No, You're it good. does not fall out. Gucci. You got stuff that's in there in your body, and it just yeah. absorbs. It's like a sponge. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Um, so, is it what? <laughs> you got any questions or anything you want to drop in? We'd love to hear from you as well. Instant voice notes. We're gonna go back to them here in just a few minutes with what's that noise? Uh, remember, if you win, what's that noise? You get nothing. <laughs> Uh, but the respect of myself and Denise right. for actually figuring out the noise, which I will be playing for you here in just a few minutes. Also, uh, I'm pretty excited about this. It might work. It might not. I don't know what's going to happen, right? But I, I, I'm going to need the chat's help okay. right, to come up with some words, and together we're going to put something together. Together, together we're, we're gonna, gonna put something together. together we're gonna finish something. Uh huh. We're, we're gonna complete. Yeah. There and we then go. and then uh, and then we're gonna go to uh, well, just follow my lead coming up in just a few minutes. I think it could be fun. Is it job related? No, it's more of a oh, okay. <laughs> because I want to do some fun stuff. It's Saturday night. We're it's gonna play Saturday some games. Night, you know, right. so I want to get you guys involved. Is what I'm saying. So if you're watching or if you're listening live to the show, I want to get you involved, and um, we're gonna be doing that uh, in just a few again with uh, a little. I don't even have a name for this. Oh, come. I'll so, to you. Yeah. so we'll see. We'll see what happens. Uh, yes. I uh, I am ready if you are to do a little roll call. Why don't we do a roll call? Cause the people must, must be heard. heard. I got Dina is checking in from Buford. Shay is in nice. Jackson. We got Shay. I haven't Shay, seen you. How the hell are you, Shay, buddy? What's going on? We got Ace Gilmore, Oak Forest, watching the Astros. Shout out. Yeah, baseball season officially Let's here. Go. The Magonzo in Woodlands. We got Auto Tech Nerd, Porterville. Rose, sister in law. Hey. What's up, Rose? Hello. I think I mentioned you on the plus show. I was talking about how bad I felt for anybody uh, that's been in a car that Denise was driving. Whoa, excuse you, me? You popped into my head. Excuse so I, me. You know, so shout out to well, you if you missed the plus show. I guess I go. apparently got to listen to the plus show yeah, because what the I, fuck? Do, I do not know How what about you're talking you about. Support your husband <laughs> when I'm talking to myself doing a plus show, <laughs> dropping free shows. I should listen. Not free not, shows. Not but free. No, yeah, I'm not free. I, I got to subscribe. subscribe. But anyway, in Gladstone is Rose. We got Tressa and Tigard, Leslie Donalds to join us from You know what? I'm not going to support you and your job. <laughs> I'm going to stay at a different hotel. <laughs> Why are you staying at our hotels? We live here. Uh, we got Bradley and Alvin. Good point. <laughs> Walking to Dairy Queen. Hey, what's up? Uh, Carol's in Salem. We got Costco Boy. Costco Boy. Listening in my earpiece from Costco. Costco. In Checking Cooper. in from Costco. Costco's open right now? Yeah. What is it, 5 o'clock? You're on the West Coast? That's right. How, yeah. how late is Costco open? Is it 8? I don't know. When do they hey, shut it down? Sounds good, yeah. We got uh, hmm. Heart Reborn in Mableton. Charlene uh, Clackamas joining us. Won't be too long. It's okay. You're still joining us. We got Freddie in Stockbridge. Who's Bootleg. making all the food tonight? Bootleg. I saw you in the uh, Discord a little while ago. But uh, and then there's somebody that's making like a gang of food. Yeah. It looked pretty fucking good. I, for I for Easter, because like a lot of people are celebrating like today and like getting together Why? with the fam. It's not today. Well, it's, I don't know. What if you got two families and uh, you got to do one you today, one pick tomorrow? Your favorite. You can't. Pick your favorite. Yeah, she, she, oh my God, she's who's that? Oh, Dina. What is that? What is that? Dina. Just making food for days. Is that uh, a des that's a dessert, right? Is that? I don't know what that is. It looks that's, like uh, is marshmallows. It marshmallows. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Delicious. Lasagna? Is that lasagna? Dina, you making lasagna? What the? Yeah. Dina, you making lasagna? <laughs> Oh, break into that house and steal all that food. Oh, my God, yeah. If it's for tomorrow. Jacqueline's in Sugar Land. Wake up an empty kitchen. By the way, yeah. Yeah. I'm just checking in with everybody. So everybody doing good? Everyone's doing great. Nice. I got to go through your notes, too. I haven't even had a chance to... Oh, uh, that's all right. Why am I... Are it, you sick? I, I'm not sick, but yeah. I'm still not completely on top of my game. Like, what the hell's... Did we go... We didn't go too hard last night. No, no. So this is what happened after the show last Wednesday... Uh, not last Wednesday, Wednesday prior. What was, was it? Was it two weeks? Yeah, because like crap. I don't think like we didn't make it for like after St. Patrick's Day. Yeah. So our last show was the thirteenth. Denise I think. gives me this soup. No, first, maybe it was first, the twentieth. Maybe it first, was the twentieth. Uh there's a doctor here that prescribed you anything. You know what I mean. So okay. cut the shit. That's why you're going to her. 
Yeah, because I got better uh, in an hour. Okay. <laughs> yeah. okay. In an you hour. You got new insurance, so she can go back to this doctor that gives you whatever you need. Uh, to like, feel better. Yeah. That we had from the first time. Because we lived in Houston. We moved to Atlanta. We came back to Houston, right? But our uh, bootleg insurance when we came back to Houston didn't cover that doctor. So we had another doctor, which I still like. Yeah. I still use uh, the, the new doctor after we moved back. But the minute that the insurance hit, uh, My, it, yeah. and what happened was she got sick. So she went to this original, let's call her Pez. Pez? Yeah, she dispenses the, the <laughs> medicine like, like, a, like a dispenser, like a Pez dispenser. So we'll just call her Pez. We'll call her Pez. Mm -hmm. So She's great. So I, I take Denise, I drop her out, I come into the lobby, wait in the lobby, uh, and then you come out and you're like, oh yeah, I'm not contagious. She gave me like, what'd you get, a Z-pack or no, something? No, I got a B12 shot and a steroid shot. Yeah. Yeah. She's, she's, she's real like, you know, like she'll hand out whatever the fuck you want. I so. felt better within like, oh, that's another swear word. Or Am swear. I not supposed to swear? I don't know, but you asked somebody and someone counted like two shows ago, you swore like over 138 times. Yeah. Oh, yeah. no, I, that was on the plus show that you didn't listen to. So, <laughs> th so, so, so listen, so this doctor <laughs> tells Denise that she's not contagious. Correct, yeah. So I'm cool, you know, and by the way, I've been with Denise for like now, God knows, 15, 18 years. I don't know. It's been a long time, right? So like anytime she gets sick, just by default, I know I'm going to get we sick. We sleep so. in the same bed and I'm right here when I'm, yes. Now, do we? Yeah. Well, hold, let me finish this story. Go on. So, Go on. Bootleg doctor tells yes. Denise she's not contagious. Mm. Guess who the fuck gets sick the next day? This dude. I'm out for a week. 102 temperature, two days in a row. I mean, this, this, whatever the hell you gave me, I didn't, Mrs. I'm not contagious. I didn't have According a, to this no, bootleg no. ass I doctor. I had a sinus infection, whatever. I, I want to go back to her flu. and be like, what the F? I think you had the flu. So we both just coincidentally got sick I together at the, the same time? I didn't have the flu. You had something else. I don't know who you're hanging out with, but it wasn't me. I wasn't contagious. I took all I the tests. I took literally COVID wanted flu, to go. Oh, strep, and then you did this bootleg. Negative. Bootleg. You, you, yeah, Again? you did the, uh, sorry, bootleg, because we actually have somebody named bootleg in the. In the <laughs> but then she, she does this IV thing where they show up and I'll. They show up in a fucking van, yeah. and on the side of the van, it says something to the effect of, like, it's your IV spa. Immediately, I'm it's thinking- It's IV drip. It's like a drip. Yeah. yeah, but the van said IV spa or something. Yeah, because like in the back of it, it's like a spa. The second it's I like saw it, I'm like, this sprinter. is a scam. The second. I but then she's sick, and I don't want to tell her I that she's an idiot and wasting $200, so I said nothing. Yeah, it was really expensive. But I have like a coworker who she like swears by it. She's like, I felt so sick, dehydrated, she blah, probably blah. owns it. And <laughs> she maybe got a kickback. But no, like well, the guy came in, and, and speaking of IVs, Shout out Ben Rash joining us. Oh, Ben, what, what the up? fuck is up, Ben? He, he, he can he, attest to it. The shit doesn't work. No, he got in Vegas. And yeah, yeah, did it work? I don't know. I don't remember I don't him working. I don't remember working. it working or but not. But I also do remember that he was so out of it. Yeah. Hold on. I got to fix something real quick. Hold on, everybody. Okay. Uh, Akisha, can I still talk or no? Uh, I, yeah, silent? but what you have to say is not as important as what I have to say. Uh, so Ben Excuse went so me. hard in Vegas that there wasn't <laughs> enough IVs on the planet to get him to bounce back. But coincidentally, and I don't know if it's a thing about the name Ben, uh -huh. but our uh, Bad Stats Benny, yeah. our Oregon Ben friend, yeah. in Vegas, he got like next level and then did the IV as well. But then he, he was so hung over that the IV just made him go back to bed. Uh, so you had to just sleep throughout. Oh. So it didn't really help him either. I mean, but I think like that one helps like with dehydration. So it definitely is like a ton of fluids because it's like an, I don't know, the, the doctor or whoever that came say like that whole thing was like two gallons of water. And then just, yeah, poked me with yeah, the needle. And she's like, getting paid for an 200 hour. fucking dollars. So I felt better-ish. But then it wasn't until the following day where I got like the B12 and steroid shot that I was like, all right, now I'm like good to go. Let's, let, me, let me just oh, go. Let's, let's just go to the horse's mouth. <laughs> Whoa, what the? Bless you. Is that what you Christ. Say? That's how I got sick. Hi, uh, you've reached Ben Nance. I'm not available to get to my phone. Oh, Leave me please. a message. Give me your number. Give me the number. Thanks. Ah, uh, you lucky bastard. <laughs> Fuck, bro. I know you're watching the show and your phone's right there. Fuck. But yeah, bad stats, Benny. Uh, does wait. he know we call him that? No, he doesn't. Okay, he doesn't well, watch the show, does he? He's right in the chat now. I thought you said that was Ben Nance. No, it's Benny. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you called the wrong my fucking guy. You called the wrong Benny. What's up, homie? <laughs> oh, Christ. <laughs> oh, do, now do I call? <laughs> yes, you got to call. Oh, oh Jesus. Oh, man. Oh, that, I just, I've really <laughs> done it now. <laughs> oh. You got to listen. <laughs> my God. Why am I so stupid? <laughs> You need to listen. Actually, I don't know if I have his. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah, I do. You have his 
number. Well, because been- no, I have a lot of Bens in my phone, and one of them is called Ben Dammit. <laughs> so why would I put his last name as Ben Dammit? D a m m m i t. I didn't even like. I don't fucking get. I, oh my god! You know people can tell like when you. So I told his story. Yeah, you told Benny's. Thinking I'm an idiot. Yeah, you are. I was like wrong, Benny. Peak. <laughs> Hi, bro. <laughs> Howdy. <laughs> Did the IV shit work for you? Yes. It, it, okay, I've done it three times. Dude, you were out. All three times in Vegas. You didn't come out of your room that day. You went to, you no. did the IV, you did the pool for like a half hour, and you were out. Well, I, you, you get older, and you, <laughs> you know how it works. <laughs> and when I was 25, it worked great. Dude. <laughs> I know, I know. That's why I got a younger wife, so maybe it did work for her. <laughs> so you honestly think it did help? It, did, it does work? 100% work. So three times I've done it. Two out of three times it worked. The last time when me and Coach did it, yeah. it just it's game over, bro. I'm, I'm too old. I'm just, it's not. It doesn't matter. Like there's no there's no going back. I was like the rapture. There's no going back. You're just done. Just pack it in, call it a day. You got to sleep it off, or you just got to hit hit it hard again. There's oh, only you're only two ways out. Hit it hard again. Oh dude, my god, dude, life came at us so fucking quick. Like when did we become old? This yeah. When did we become old? What happened to the, like the old nighters and like one of my favorite since I have you on right now one of my favorite all time stories and I don't even know if you remember it but it was Oktoberfest uh-huh. and uh, we're all trashed and um, I don't even I know it was, was it Ryan too I think it was Ryan and maybe I don't know who else we walk up to like this it wasn't it was like a gas station but it, they didn't it was like it was a shut down gas station and because it's Oktoberfest people are parked everywhere right so this dude was in his own car in the passenger side passed out yeah right we didn't know this guy right you get in the driver's side and move his car <laughs> with him sleeping dude it was oh the fucking epic bro hey you know i mean uh bud light makes you do crazy things uh, <laughs> and just to be clear it was only like forward like you know like five feet or something like, you know but it was hysterical because yeah. the fucking owner of the car is in there i'm like balls man yeah balls. i don't think you could do that this day and age yeah. I was, uh, yeah, yeah 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 yeah. you get caught you get caught and you'd get arrested and, and bad things would happen you know, different different world we were in a different world back then. different was world that was 15, 15 years ago 15 years ago yeah dude yeah. shit came at us quick son quick how's it, everything it else does. Man? you're good you moved i heard you moved right Great, we moved. We're here. When you guys come up this summer, I'll have you over. You know, whole, new, whole routine. Got a, got, a, got a room for you all still. So, but uh, we're in town. A little more room. But, uh, we're not on top of each other as much. And uh, life's always good. Life's nice. good, man. Aww, well, love great to hear fucking that. talking to you, bro. I miss you. So, uh, yeah, miss we gotta, you too. We gotta uh, do some July third, July. Hey, July thirteenth, golf tournament again. Oh, come on, July? make it happen, okay. dude. I haven't made it happen in twenty years. You think I'm gonna start now? <laughs> we, we well, you, you last oh, year you kind of no. did. Yeah, you, kinda, you were out yeah. for it, but you weren't here for it. Yeah, yeah, that's true. That's true. You guys have some crazy. Th- these dudes do an auction, and I've never been to like the amount of stuff you guys give away is just. I- I've never seen anything like it. Well, it's it's uh what'll be our fourteenth year doing it. And wow. so it's literally just uh all for charity too. All for charity. Uh, yeah, it's all yeah. it's all it all goes to all goes to school athletics. So uh yeah, I mean you just get better. It's just like anything. You get better at it, you know what I mean? Yeah, for sure, man, for sure. Well, except listen, for man. curing hangovers. Except for curing hangovers. <laughs> we'll get better at that. That's always worse. That is always worse. <laughs> all right, man. Well listen, uh love you and uh yeah, we'll uh we'll make some trips happen. All right, peace out, brother. All right, man, all right, see you. Bye. So I got, I, you know, <laughs> in you PK fashion, I'm a fucking idiot. I guess the IV stuff did work. So did it work for you? No. <laughs> no. You bounced I mean, back. I, you didn't have the temperature, though. No, I, I felt better, but I wouldn't say, like, it cured me, like, in my head I thought it would. Um, yeah. Well, no, it was just, like, those two other shots that so then, happened. So then... Bitch ass doctor. Oh, she's not contagious. She's not contagious. No, I wasn't because like I again I tested COVID, flu, strep, nothing because like my coworkers they were shout out they're all watching right now. Hey, hey, Uh, hey, how the hell are you? Uh, But they were like Denise, do not come in. Like do not come in. Like because we have a shared office and we're so close. Like you know germs, I sneeze and they get it. It's like awful. And I don't. I'm like, but I have to come in. Like I physically have to come. I I guarantee you, if I called them, they would probably say you didn't have to. You're just a control freak. I am. I am. And I think behind my back, they like talk about me that I'm too. Hunter, I talk about you behind your back. (laughs) Or in front. Yeah, right, right in your face. In the front. Yeah. Hey, what up? The chat before we go live. (laughs) All they're doing is talking about you. Uh Um. So then, so uh, so you did want to get any of them sick as well? I don't. Or just me. So. I don't think I got uh, him sick. 
I wonder I mean, if the, we the doctor was saying you're not contagious at this point. So maybe I have to apologize to her and everything I yeah, just to, said. To, maybe to Dr. Pez, maybe correct. she the Pez dispenser was talking about like, well, you know, a couple of days ago when you first got the cold, you were contagious, maybe. but you're not right now. Yeah. In either anyway, case, you laid me out for like a week. You were so dramatic. You oh. have what I call the man flu. Oh. My God. It was uh, okay, so to be honest, I had the best weekend ever last weekend because PK was so sick, in air quotes. Yeah. But you, like, laid out in bed, and I was like, you're quarantined in the bedroom. Like, I'm not sleeping. Like, I slept downstairs, but I had the best weekend. Let me tell and you. I would like to go uh, back to amazing. earlier on this show. Yeah. Earlier on this show, as you're watching it back, I know people drop in timestamps of when things happen. Do me a favor. Yeah. Uh, drop a timestamp. Uh, replay, gang, gang, gang. Drop a timestamp when she was like, eh. Mm. Would you set something to the what effect of like, uh, I, I, uh, and I just, I always sleep next to him. I do, and yeah, I didn't not, get sick not or whatever. when he had the flu. I get sick. This yeah. is nowhere to be found. I don't want a fever. Nowhere to be know. found. No, I gave, you be quiet. You shut your mouth. I got you all sorts of things from the grocery store. I made sure that you, you were very well job. taken care yeah, of. And I, I'm so nerdy. Like I deep cleaned and I got to like steam my clothes. I was like, I'm a happy person. Everything was organized. I was like, this is the best weekend ever. My like OCD totally kicked in. I was like, you keep sleeping and let me just go to town. Yeah. I'm so weird. I wasn't even sick. I'm like, keep fucking cleaning. Yeah. Yeah, I know. No, I was sick. PK sick holiday. I was so <laughs> <From> sick. Sean. <laughs> <laughs> it, I need that to get a holiday around here. Mm -hmm. um, even it says the guy without a job. Um, I was so sick though. You know when like you 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 know you get the pass. You're in bed like you can't even like focus on your favorite TV shows because you just don't feel you know. And you yeah. want to feel just a. You don't want to feel bad. Uh, you know you don't want to feel like well enough to to get up and to do things. Yeah. You just want to feel well enough to be able to enjoy your TV show. <laughs> As you let your body rest. Uh-huh. And I wasn't there. It's like, it sucked. You, I, you so laid really me worse? out. I didn't lay you out. Yeah. I didn't have that. Try to kill me. I did not have a fever Fuck, I'm probably putting anything. like uh, yeah. antifreeze in my drinks. So I gave you Theraflu, which by the way. Yeah. Yeah, you love that. No, I hate it. I hate it. I don't understand. If, if you like the taste of Theraflu, you're a psychopath. <laughs> well, I'm like, who in what lab was like, Yes, let's create this, and people will microwave it's, the hot water. It's almost like tea. Hmm, this tastes good. I don't know who came up with that, but those people grew up on chemicals, better. just sipping chemicals. Okay, you also are one that takes NyQuil nightly to sleep, which is very dangerous. Every night. Every single every night. Every goddamn sick night. Sick or not sick. Oh, I shouldn't say that because uh. it's Easter tomorrow. Uh, yeah, well, no, not every night, but like NyQuil helps really? me fall asleep. There's but... trash out there, and in there is an empty bottle of NyQuil that you just cracked open last weekend. You have a problem. You have a NyQuil addiction, and it's very worrisome. Mm. Yeah. I tried the z to be fair, uh -huh. but I don't know, that because that did not help at all. What? Are you doing, like, NyQuil and, like, are no, you making some... No, because the z some... is without the medicine. Are you making some lean, lean over there? Are you leaning? Houston, what's up? What's up? Slow, low, and banging. Slob. Slob? Slob, right? Slow, lo slow low, and slob. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> God. Ridiculous. On it tonight. <laughs> I I gotta give some more love. Speaking of my coworkers, come on. How much they love you, and I'm like, I think that. They, but they're they, not the love. They love PK more than me. Even like not just them, but like my shout out to like Marissa who did my hair today. Yeah. I like, hung out with her for three hours. Uh, she's like, you know, I go and I scroll through Instagram, and I only stop on PK's post because he is so funny. You know, like no, he's not. Like, I mean, I'll take that. <laughs> I've never heard I've stopped on PK's post because he's so sexy. I've never yeah. heard that once. No, no, you're a funny uh, boy. So I'll have to take funny. Uh, you know? boy. Um, <laughs> yo, your hair lady, though, she's nuts. Why? Like, what? She's ours, by the way. Yes. Yes, we both see her. But you see her more often. Um, but what was the story about... What was the story she told you last time? But like some, some dude went out with a girl and, like, brought her back to his place or something and, like... Was it that crazy story that she? I, or are you not supposed to share? So now you don't do want to say. I do not know what the you're last time that about. you saw her. Yeah, I know. I, I don't want to name her in case she's uh, Marissa. I, I already Shout said out. her name. I already said um, it. Yeah. But she said that there was like some crazy story that happened about a guy that was on drug. He went all night on like ecstasy or something, and then went with a different chick and was hooking up, and then his girl caught him and like shot him or something. Or <laughs> it was some crazy. How did you forget that story? <laughs> I don't know. That's such a crazy story. <laughs> I don't know. Like. Are you sure? I'm sure. That that's Are you sure not your real not, hair color. You're not dreaming. 
You told me the entire way back. <laughs> we might have shared this story already on the show. I don't remember. Uh, I can't, you don't want to share it. Just say you don't want to share I the story. I don't remember the details. It's fine. People tell me stuff, and I'm like, I don't know if I'm supposed to repeat it. I know. Say so it. Don't here, say Here's it. the thing. Everyone's like, this is between you and I, or this is to not, like, everyone's like, oh, let me tell you something. And I was like, you guys know that, like, I do a podcast, and, like, everything that I do, like, no matter what, like, we talk about all of the worst things and all the best things, like, everything that blurts out on the show. Yeah. But people still tell me, like, let me tell you something. Like, well, you, you seem very trustworthy. I am trustworthy until I get a mic in front of my They face. don't tell me nothing. Uh-huh. What's you the just... chat? Let me check the chat. Let's see what the chat is saying, what they're doing. Um... Oh, tart cherry magnesium from ACS. That? that is what I do. Oh, That's God. my nighttime cocktail. Oh, it's awful. It's my nighttime cocktail. Oh, I, I hate that. making that for you. <laughs> if anybody knows how to get the magnesium in the water without it fucking going all over the counter, please reach out <laughs> to me because I can't figure it out. Like it's awful. It's too. Who, what less TikTok water. trend were you watching? How did humanity <laughs> watch, survive all these years, and now watch, all of a sudden we're I taking magnesium? I don't watch TikTok. Well, where'd you find out about this? Thing? Uh, Instagram. <laughs> magnesium and tart cherry. Yeah, it's what is it called? And like, then she keeps adding. Like it started with just, can you warm me up some some water? Yeah. And then and then put some magnesium, oh, but, oh, but not yeah, too. That's right. It's called a sleepy girl mocktail. It's an okay. N- it's an NA. I got a sleeping girl mocktail. It's called N.A.? Do you know what that is? <laughs> oh, that was creepy. Uh, huh? You got a sleeping girl cocktail? Uh-huh. You know the creepy guys at the bar that slips, you know, like that, that oh. you know, got to sleep. Do I, if I have to explain the joke? The joke is just... Lame and terrible. Yeah. Let's not repeat. So she starts with, like, <laughs> can you just make me heat up some water and put the stuff in there, right? And then, then I get yelled at the first time because I put too much shit in there. I'm like, teaspoon. Like, how can I mess that up? So I finally get that right. So then she 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 brings like uh, the the cherry to the mix. Yeah, tart right? cherry juice. And then she brings like carbonated water to them. I'm like, yeah, how many soda. things go in it's this slime. drink? Yeah, it's a mocktail. And then why doesn't somebody just include all those things in a beverage and you just buy that? Like it's just like every time I make this, you <laughs> just add something else on it. Every time you make it, what like once? Oh, at least three times. <laughs> it's like it's like something you do for me every night. Every time I make you coffee, I swear. No. All right. Um, I said, uh, did you have anything else? Cause, uh, I'm going to continue to end this conversation. Okay. <laughs> I ended this conversation. <laughs> continue to end the conversation. I, I, I like the last. Look at those fancy glasses, by the way. Yeah, I'm surprised you haven't smashed these to hell. Oh. I mean, I gave you like two weeks and I was wrong. Uh-huh, yeah. Uh, because you are uh, you you, know what I the hurricane of smashing wine glasses. So, like, we got these at Nordstrom Rack. I saw them. I was like, oh, my God, those are so cute. And then, like, we go over to our friends, like, Chantel and Elia's house. They have these exact same wine glasses. No wonder uh, why I like them. I'm like, oh, my what God. A I am. You probably stole it from them. I totally they're did. They're at the house right now. And they're like, oh, we're missing two glasses. Oh, I'm sure they're somewhere. <laughs> Fucking Denise in her purse. Remember the, the wine glass you stole from the... Uh, <laughs> I don't steal. Yeah, from uh, who was the, the EDM show that we went to? Oh, yeah. Who yeah, steals yeah. a wine glass <laughs> champ- it was from a, an EDM show? It was Crystal. <laughs> you still don't steal it. <laughs> who was it? Uh, it was one of the. Uh, Alice. How no, do I it's not know? one of the, the three guys that goes, Don't you worry. Don't, don't you, you worry. worry child. Alessandro. Three-eyed. Alesso. Alesso. What's his name? <laughs> I'm trying to think of the band that I should know, but my old brain, yeah. no idea. Yeah. All right, let me do something with the chat real quick. Swedish House Mafia. Swedish House Mafia. Did go. you look that up or did somebody put it in the chat? I totally did. It said, don't you worry. Uh, the not so crystal glass. No, the shit is crystal. Yeah, that's why I stole it. Yeah. I mean, what else? Lesso, we were just going to like toss it. So it was part of um, Alesso's writer. Like, you know. Like, that he wanted when, crystal? When you have like an artist and like you have like hospitality or whatnot, like you have like a writer of everything. I only want red M&Ms. I want like hot tamales that are great. I don't know. I mean, crazy. But then they have like, I want like certain champagnes and I want crystal. And so, like, we were able to take, like, the glasses because we were in the suite, and then we went down there. And then some people left them behind, but I still had champagne in mind. I'm like, well, I'm not going to chug it. I mean, I could. But they're like, oh, it's fine. Just take it with you. I'm like, okay, cool. So I took it with me, and then I was like, well, I'm not going to just, like, set it here for somebody to throw it away. Like, I'm going to keep it. How do you know that they weren't going to just take it back up? Who was going to take it up? Because you were in a VIP area where, like, the yeah, sound board that's, that's where everybody then just, like sweeps and tosses it in the trash can. There was nobody that was going to I don't know. No, I don't think you even gave that is, a chance. Nobody is even counting. They're like, oh, we used you to have six. You put that shit in your Louis bag got, oh, real quick. Yeah, everyone's like, yeah, we got six. Now we got five. Where's the... No, mm-hmm. nobody even t- keeps track because like once you give it like for hospitality stuff, it is what it is. And then it's gone and I kept it. Yeah, it's in your purse. <laughs> it's downstairs. <laughs> By the way, also, what the F? What? Last night, 
we go to uh well first I'm 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 you know speaking of being a nerd I'm trying to be a nerd I'm trying to learn uh, you know a piece on the piano so I'm I'm down there and I'm I'm doing my stuff and uh <laughs> Uh, Denise is like, oh, I'm out with the uh, the the work girls, and I said, uh, I yeah. looked at my phone, I, I did one of these. I'm like, oh, thank God, <laughs> one more time, yeah. cool. And then uh, and then she, she starts hitting me up. Why don't you come meet us? And I was like, oh fuck, yeah, here we go. Because again, all the girls they love PK. And they're like, where's PK? I like them at? too, but like where's I was PK? in the middle of something. Where's PK? And I'm like, uh, uh-uh, is this ladies' night out? Guess what she does? What? Guess what she does? What do I do? She orders me an <laughs> Uber. Uber shows up. I don't even know where the f I'm going. All I know is that there's a car out front. I may or may not be a little controlling. Yeah, you think? <laughs> I do. I get in this Uber, and he's like, "Are you ready to go?" And I'm like, "I don't know where you're taking me, but go." <laughs> so um, you're such a good husband. It's, it's a good group of people, Great, you know. But yeah. the, the the problem that I had about last night is like, uh, I show up, I walk inside. If you're not in the Houston area, um, Christmas tailgate is like it's not a dive bar, but it's not like a it's really a, fancy. I bar. would say like sports, like an bar. outdoorsy it's, sports bar, it's right? Super cash. Yeah, yeah. A lot of people super, super cash. Okay, Valley girl. <laughs> so I walk in, a lot of people, right? A lot of, lot of foot traffic and stuff. And I uh, and, uh, walk up to the table and uh, look down. And your purse is on the fucking ground. Uh-huh. This purse was like real expensive. I don't have a job anymore. I'm about to take it to the pawn shop. <laughs> Please explain yourself. Why, why is it on the ground? It should I, not be on the ground. What? I even know that. Should I put it on a chair? You uh, Find a hook. Find There's a chair. No put it in the back of your chair. There's no hook. Is there any ladies in the chat? Do you put your purses on the ground? Uh, there was definitely some beverages involved. Usually, never on the I ground. Ever put it on dirty the ground. ass ground? Yeah, never. Uh-uh. Dirty ass. That's ground. what you out of everything that we did last night. Uh-huh. That's what you remember. Yeah, the purse being on the floor. Because I had to pay for that purse. <laughs> oh, you had to pay no, like fifteen years ago. Yeah, so <laughs> that, does, that means that there's us uh, the the prize inflation. <laughs> Biden's America. Oh, that purse is probably like three times the price now. Yeah. Don't put it on the ground. Yeah. What yeah. are you doing? I know everyone's like bad luck. Hell no, never on the ground. Thank oh. you. Chat, thank I, you. Yeah, mm. replay gang, gang, gang. Drop me your instant voice notes online at pkndk.com. Uh, that thing I wanted to try to, we're gonna do it, but first, let's take some guesses for what's that noise. Because also, mm. I, I should uh, say this too you can drop your guesses uh, live during the show. So if you if you haven't dropped one yet and you're listening and you're like, oh, I think I know what it is, boom, go to uh, the website pkndk.com. Hopefully, it's still up. Uh, God willing. Uh, uh, <laughs> God willing. Go there on a mobile phone. You'll see the <laughs> Ivan button. You hit that. Your comments come right to us. Let's go. What's the noise? Now, let's start with the noise. Remember, we recorded this in Kauai. Is it Kauai or Kauai? Kauai. The, the locals reserve saying it Kauai. I just say Kauai. Okay. That's Here we you. go. All right, let's take some guesses. And again, uh, this router, what's that noise? You have to leave your guesses online uh, through the Ivan system. It's the voice notes, correct. The voice notes, what did I say? Guesses, well, whatever. That's fine. You guys know what I'm talking about, here we go. Uh, hi, it's Bev, my guess for oh, the... hi, Bev. Uh, what's that noise? She can't hear you, it's recorded. a bonfire? It's a pre-recorded message. Oh, I thought we were doing it live. Yeah, but that's a pre-recorded message. I don't want you talking to her, and like I didn't want you to be like, "Oh, she's well, not really gonna, there." I was gonna talk back to her, but okay, I know. It's fine. You know, I know. It's Hi, it's Bev. Hey, my Bev. guess for the uh, what's that noise is a bonfire. Sounds like fire crackling. Mm. Okay, bye. I mean, I can hear that. Oh yeah, that's a great guess. Yeah, that's a great guess. Uh, one more, real quick. My guess for what's that noise. Has to be the fan that you finally worked on after I don't know a year and a half. <laughs> yes, yes, it was that. I feel like you're just coming that? at me. Yes, I don't think that that was I, a, I need to a leave, worthy guess. I need to leave. The other guesses. is just coming after me. My guess is the toilet that PK hasn't oh, fixed in two years. Here he's fucking go. He <laughs> hasn't came over yet. We need him to fix that. Yeah, have you asked him? No. By the way, it is, it is not the ceiling fan that PK. Denise dropped such a load, it broke her toilet <laughs> no, for a it's year. Not, that is not true. A fuck a year. No. It, it, mm. I was going to call the handyman. I'm the handyman. What <laughs> other handyman are you going to call? Uh, what's That's the, how women cheat on their guys. When they, they call the, the guys, handyman? When the guy's too lazy. Oh, my God. Oh, handyman. my God. Okay, by the way, that is not it. But yeah. great guess. Do you have another one or can I continue uh, that's with it, my that's story? It. If you have your guesses, though, please drop them. And if I get them throughout the show, uh, I'll play them <laughs> real time. So I do not know how this conversation really started, but... 
Is it true mm-hmm. if you see a man and a woman like kissing at like a grocery store or restaurant, that means that they're married to somebody else? Because like what married couple does that? Uh, it's only the beginning if you're of like, a relationship. It, it's only like if you're if they're like the the other. That's an interesting yeah. question. Yeah. So I like, don't know. So like we I've were never thought of that. We were talking about like this this lady who happened to be seduced in air quotes by the neighbor, aka her like best friend's husband. Oh, and she was shit. like Yeah, I don't want I can't I can't know these people. I can't share this story How did because he seduce like, her? we we gotta get like the person who who knows. I don't this wanna story talk to the guy the that seduced her. Yeah. But apparently like yeah, the the wife of the guy like moved out with the kids and everything. So now the guy is still living oh, next door. They were door. both married? Yes. Oh, they were both and then the married, guy went after kids, the other wife. Had kids that oh. were friends and yeah. yeah. Yeah, so she's like, yeah, he seduced me. I messed up. He seduced me. Oh, boy. She oh. got caught making out at the grocery store. I'm like, who's kissing at the damn grocery store? I'm like, that's when you know that it is not your husband. Like, who's making out at a grocery store? Okay. Now, really? You, you, gave me, you gave me some more, uh, you know, pieces uh, of the story. So yeah. F out of here with the whole seducing thing. Exactly. Now, all of a sudden, then she doesn't want to take any kind of blame. Exactly. So now she's the victim. seduced me. No, Shut the no, F off. No, you opened up your legs, man. Yeah. Yeah, keep yeah. those closed. It takes two to tango. Yep. Now, see, I've always said something. I've always said, I think the person that's a little more guilty in situations like that is the one that's married because they took the, the vow, the other person didn't. Yeah. Not giving the other person a pass. Um, but that's just how I feel about it. Yeah. One person's age is like, you know, it's not a 50-50 thing. Yeah. I think it's like an 80 Okay, well, they, so, so, but, but they were both married. Yeah, like, what I'm saying is, like, think of it like a Chantel and Elia situation. Like, we're super close, right? But then all of a sudden, like, uh, with Elia. In case they're watching. (laughs) You kiss them. (laughs) But, like, but literally, like, they were that close of, like, friendships. And then, like, the opposites got together. And then she's like, yeah. I I would definitely, 100%, like, if there was, uh, yeah, I would definitely, uh, leave you for Elia. Uh, uh, you know, huh? I can just watch TV and just <laughs> oh my God. Yeah, no daily ear beatings. He'd fix the toilet all the time. The ceiling fan wouldn't have to. I wouldn't be getting guesses right now for the ceiling fan oh. coming after me. Oh, my uh, God. Yeah, it'd be, are, it'd be are a good you, life. You, okay, well, he's he's taken <laughs> and has a baby. So I guess yeah. you're stuck with me after all these 15 Bad years. <laughs> no kidding. So grocery store kisses. Yeah. What about, though, in the beginning of a relationship in, during who's, the lust phase? Who's kissing at the grocery store, though? I love, like, in the beginning of relationships? Like, kissing is great. Like, well, I know, make out but wherever. you're like, ooh, let's go look at the bananas. <laughs> <laughs> like, no. I don't think I've seen a person that? kiss at a grocery no, store. No, it's before. weird. It was weird. Huh. Or even like at, at dinner, like I guess like late night, like you're having like dessert and wine. You're like, oh, I love you. But not like. Uh, <laughs> that's no, weird. that's not. Your little pecs isn't equal. Like like whenever I drop you off at work and you're like, oh, I got the cheek. Yeah. Like what's the difference? It's just like, Mwah. It's like meh. You know, like if you want to tongue me, I'm not that's, gonna... that shows me you're appreciative of my driving you to work. <laughs> just a little. All right. Meh. You know what? Next week, I'm just going to yeah. take the car and kiss myself. You got to. Mwah. Put put your heart and soul into it. Put a little tongue out I there. I am not gonna make. You're gonna get the lips out with you before I go into work. Oh, That's ridiculous. Let's make it happen. Oh my god. Tell me you appreciate me. <laughs> okay. Let's let's do something with the chat. I'm curious. Did Dina? Did you just say no daily ear beatings from Elia? <laughs> yeah, Elia. Yeah, because he... you and Elia fight more than you oh, and I that's fight. A good point. So let's yeah. calm down. Yeah, it would just take like one visit to like uh, one of the little chicken wing places and then divorce. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> I'm thinking out loud now. You yeah, know, you're getting, now you're happens. divorced from Elia. Oh yeah, God! Well, yeah, I'm think back he, with the niece, everybody. He, he, he's with his family right now. Otherwise, I'm sure he'd be giving you a call. <laughs> like, what is wrong with y'all? <laughs> um. So I did want to. Uh. In this, the you, earlier, I talked about the 12 kid situation, and uh, we played that instant voice note. If you did, I did I say this? Like, if you do have somebody drop us your instant voice notes, I'd love to hear that. But I had um I had another question that I wanted to ask for um. Uh, we used to, when we did the show daily, we'd do one random question. Every right. day we'd ask a different question, but since we're not doing it daily, I can just toss out a few questions. Okay. what I'm saying. Okay. So um, we went to a brewery and uh, we were hanging out with somebody that we had met before yeah. that actually checked out the show and I thought it was oh cool God, that yeah. he was playing it at the bar too. Yeah, they checked in. So shout out to yeah. uh, Sam and Paige of, what is it? Elder? I don't want to get it wrong. Oh crap. Yeah, Elder. give him some love. Hold on. Oh, Christ. This is why. This Elder is why the- Sun Brewing. 
I was like, I know it yeah. was elder. Finally, somebody are watching the show and fucks the, up the name. I just forgot like the second word, Elder Sun Brewing, which is like right across from the K Bar uh, Kroger. That we <laughs> they weren't open yet, so we went to. That. We got problems. Um, I, I literally I see like, and her name's Kelly. And she checks us out too. But I was like, I saw Kelly at Kroger, and I was like, oh, when are you opening? She's like, soon. I'm like, oh god, I can't wait till soon. <laughs> <laughs> I need mean, now. So like, we went across and like met up with yeah Sam. <laughs> so he was telling me that like uh, a buddy of his. Um, they were going to go check out like this, uh, like this heavy rock band, local heavy rock band. Right. Um, and his buddy's like, do you want to go check them out? Cause we started talking about like different venues in the Houston area. Cause Houston's such a big town that you have these pockets. And like, even if you've lived here your entire life, like there's parts of the city that are like a complete different city oh, for with, sure. with the vibe and the yeah. different places that open and close. And there's just so much that happens in the city. So his buddy's like, hey, do you want to go to this to this rock show? And he's like, yeah. So he calls up uh, some girl he was talking to that he knew from high school. Yeah. Right? Like a friend, yeah. A, a friend. She was like, she was like, hey, do you want to go? So they, I guess they meet there. So she comes out of, she said the, the first problem was like she gets out of the car and she's got Uggs on. And this is like, <laughs> like hard rock. Heavy metal is yeah. what I would say. <laughs> he said after they went, he Found out somehow, because uh, I guess you went to the, which is rookie mistake. You got to go to the Instagram of the bar before you go to the bar, not after. He went after to the Instagram and found out it's a satanic, which I didn't know that they had those. I didn't know those. that was a thing. I can't believe we're talking about this the day before Easter. Yeah. There's a satanic bar? I had, like, I, I had no idea that that yeah, was a it, thing. I, when I looked it up, it said it was a community venue. So I'm like... Night time's the right time. Uh, first. Apparently. Yeah. So he shows up with this girl. I, I should have asked him, were you trying to impress her? Because you're not scoring any kind of points right now, right? <laughs> so it's him and this girl and then this buddy that invited him to and his girlfriend. So they show up and I guess in this satanic bar, like I can't believe I'm even saying, I can't believe that he told me the story that I'm even repeating it, yeah. that this actually happens. Yeah. So they go in and before the rock band goes on, then they have a burlesque show. A, yeah, burlesque, yeah. And it's like South Houston, it's sketch, right? I guess where else would you put a satanic bar? I don't know, I'm just saying. Um, so burlesque show starts. So his buddy that's there with the girlfriend, right? They're sitting there, they're watching the burlesque show, and then his girl is like, uh-huh, this is where you brought me? Yeah. Like, you didn't know this was going to happen? And guess what the fuck happens? His ex walks out on stage, was in the burlesque show. <laughs> she was stripping. <laughs> doing her thing no chance he didn't know right i mean There's no way i mean he did he did leave and go outside because yeah how awkward is it you're with your new chick and you're watching your ex like let me applaud that one more time sexy what a move to pull <laughs> so that's all that to tell you uh my second question that i wanted to ask uh you and uh and drop us your instant voice notes we'll play them next week or hell during the show or whatever but like uh tell me about that one time you ran into an ex and it doesn't have to be like a crazy story like that maybe it was a good meeting maybe it was a bad meeting maybe it was just like oh god she's here i gotta avoid her strategically how do i get a different kind of booth have you ever ran into an ex yeah. unexpectedly when? yeah yeah and then he decided to be like friends with you he's like oh pk i love you and it was really uncomfortable I'm a good guy. Yeah, but yeah. I, uh, yeah, it was at a club and oh, in the Portland. Uh huh. Oh yeah. Yeah. Was oh, this that guy that you left in Rome? Was he that guy? No, 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 no. That guy doesn't talk to me anymore. Yeah, no shit. <laughs> I wouldn't either. <laughs> no, it was a different guy. Uh, and, and another one. Wow. Another one. I got many. And another one. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, and he was like, "Oh yeah, good to see. Oh PK. Oh God, I love you." I'm like, "Of course, everyone loves PK. All right, you guys be bros." Change numbers. Uh, <laughs> I think we've got some other drinks and stuff. Yeah. yeah. So uh, tell me about that one time you ran into an ex. If you got something, pkndk.com, hit the Ivan button. Your comments will come uh, right to us. Let me do this because otherwise we're going to get to the end of the show. And, uh, and Is it I, game time? I, I, it, it, yeah, it's sort of a game. I just want to get the chat a little more involved. And I think Let's do it. Could be fun. Could be fun. I, I don't want to have... Um, I got an article, right? This is like a headline from uh, from a news... Uh, from Daily Mail? Uh, it's the only thing yes. you read. Just yeah. don't fucking look it up. Why did you call me out on it? You only read the Daily Mail. I it's don't. So I weird. read... Yes. It's a collection of stories you there. You read a collection have, of stories from the Daily Mail. That's I it. I have Google News Feed on my thing, oh, too. Oh, on your thingy. Hmm. Okay. What do you read? I don't have time. Oh. <laughs> I read Mo News. I got a job. I don't have time no, I read, for I current do. affairs. I do. I read Mo. And you remember we had him. Yeah, Mo's yeah. cool. Yeah, we Good had guy. him on the show. 
So anyway, so this is a headline, but before telling you the headline, um, we're just going to play a little game right now, and uh, I'm going to look at the chat, and uh, I'm going to ask you to throw out some words, and we're going to fill in the blanks, Got and it. then uh, we'll see. That like Mad Libs. Yes. Yeah. Is that a thing? Mad Libs? I okay. loved Mad Libs. Oh, my God. I'm not joking. I got in so much trouble when I was a kid growing up because, like, my friend and I used to do Mad Libs, and she would write dirty words in the Mad Libs, and then my parents found it, and I had a talking to. Denise, we Denise. do not. We were okay with you being a hooker for Halloween, <laughs> but this is over the line. Do not use the word penis. <laughs> <laughs> You said that to you? <laughs> no kidding. You're like, okay, dad, dick. <laughs> I love my parents so much. Uh, did you? Uh, but I know that you're mouthy. Did you say anything? Like, I, no, no, no. It wasn't me. Did you know me. that he found it? No. I, yeah, they went through all of my stuff. I got in a lot of trouble because I try to hide things, and they, they would go in my room, and I thought I was being secretive and hiding things. They'd find yeah. it. <laughs> found all those used condoms? Oh, that's where the line is. Okay. I moved out at 17, and you think I've used now, condoms in my room? Uh, I did want to tell you something, because I don't think that you're going to believe me or not, though, but you know how you have a diary next to your bed? Yeah. I don't read it. Okay, good. You I shouldn't. thought about it, though. Well, but it's I'm not like, a diary. I'm not going to. It's not a diary. But this it's... is weird. Why do you put it out there just to test me? No. And then I'm it's like, is me. this a test? Is she writing stuff in there about me that I should be better at like cleaning or something? No. Like, should I read it? Maybe I'm no, disappointing her called, by not reading it's it. It's called daily affirmations. So like in the morning, I, I wake up and then I write like things that happened that I was grateful for the previous day and then looking for like what would make today great. I'm like, okay, today it would be great if I didn't get yelled at, um, if I left work on time and if I got it in a workout. Like those are the things. Oh. What am I grateful for today? Oh, cuddles with PK and Teddy. You should see how many times I write that. That's a oh. lot. So that's all it is. Because uh, I'm a it's warm, a, fuzzy bear. It's not Very a, sad. it's yeah, you're a roly-poly bear. It is not a um, diary. It's just daily affirmations. Mm. So it's just that's time. Boring. I'm not going to read it then. It's just time for you like to, I don't know. Everybody needs like time for the soaps, whatever it is. You sit on the toilet and read Daily Mail. I sit in bed and write things I'm grateful for. Okay. All right. Well, I was just telling you, I thought you'd be proud of me that I don't read it. I, uh, but then I also didn't know if it was a test and I should have. And uh, and now it sounds boring. So <laughs> just keep it whatever. I, um, we're on it. I tell you about everything. Yeah. Back to my article. Tiff all is right. in the chat. Tiff, why the hell are you, Tiff? Who the F is you. Tiff? Tiffany Anderson. Oh, Tiff. In the ATL. How are you? Yeah. How's everything in Atlanta? What's uh, What's new in Atlanta? The ATL. We're going there in like two weeks. We are. Yeah. For like a day. I Oh, God. For like, an uh, I would say like 20 hours. We land at five and leave at two. Yeah. It's so Well, fast. we land at five. You never know if you ever leave. <laughs> you know, you just don't know how Atlanta <laughs> works out. I have to leave. Yeah. Um, yeah. Let's do it. So I got a, a news uh, article and then uh, let's just see what we can come up with. Right. So I need the chat and uh, you can't help. I'm just going to see what the chat says and I'll uh, right. pick different people. Um, but y'all name an organization. An organization could be like uh, Pfizer. Any, yeah, it could be could be <laughs> Pfizer. It could be like <laughs> a law that. enforcement organization. Okay. Any organization. Uh, I'll uh, just throw that out there for the chat. When uh, guesses start coming in, I'll, uh, I'll put that in there. Uh -huh. Um, the next thing that I'm going to need you to, to, to name is a celebrity, also a celebrity. All right. So first, okay. Red cross. Let's do a celebrity. Tay Tay. I knew you were going to say that. That's why I'm not asking you. Oh. Mm, PETA was good too. I just saw PETA a little, uh, after the red cross. Uh, let's see. Bruno. Bruno's good. Yeah. Why not? Uh, Diddy. <laughs> Yeah, well, we talk I about. saw I saw Bruno though. Yeah. Um. Okay. Uh. Something you did today. Something you did today. Poop. Yeah, it could be poop. <laughs> something that you did today. Um. Let's see. Let's see what. Uh, by the way, as you're putting that down, let me look at some of the other celebrities that came in. The Rock would have been great for this too. Uh, Ooh, Lizzie. Who's? Oh, yeah. Uh. Like Nap. Liz Lizzie McGuire. No. Napped. Nap. I like nap. Yeah. Um, all right. How about a group of people? A group of people. Like what do you a, mean? Like a, could be like a, a, a team, maybe a group of people, like a team, um, uh, okay. workers at a grocery store, like a group of people, a bunch of people that have like Orgy. something. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know that that would work. Is that a group of people or is that an action? I think that's an action. A band? Um... Nickelback. Yeah, but I need it to be more Nickelback is good. Okay. Actually, you know what? Yeah. Uh, because Jilly and Josh went to a Nickelback so movie apparently in a there's, theater. So apparently there's a documentary, and, and 
I, this is something I do want to bring up maybe like later on uh, in the show. I don't know how long we're going for, but I want to bring them on the on the phone and be like, why? But apparently everyone loves I'll, them. And I'll, I feel I'll like I'll call I would... them here in a second. Get, by the way, object is the last thing I need. I need an object. object. But yeah, wait, so did they tell you uh, like um, how did. How did you even find out that they oh, were? Oh, I just was chatting with Jillian. I was like, what are you guys doing today? She goes, oh, we're going to the theater to watch the Nickelback documentary at three. I'm like, what? What a random time. What? Wait, who no. goes to the theater at three o'clock okay. on a Saturday? We, we do that. Too. No, on a Saturday? Mm. No, we, when we saw Dune, it was like well, we also were pretty 11 p.m. or something. Tipped out. Yeah. All right. Let's see. Oh, Lamp. I don't think I've used one from, uh, from Rose. So lamp. Okay. So now... <laughs> My initial idea was like, now that we have everything, my initial idea was like, is to read the headline yeah. and to see if anybody can tell me what the, you know, like what the actual real story was. Okay. Or just to compare it to the real story. Okay, right? let's hear it. I was just like in bed. I'm like, this might be fun. It this might not. This is what you think of in bed. This is what the, the this Wait. is what the chat came up with. And then I'll tell you the actual news article that we did. All right. The Red Cross is set to uh, widen uh, the Bruno Mars sex probe over claims that he bragged about napping. Uh, he bribed also Nickelback and using J-Lo as a lamp mule is what we actually came out with. The real story was Fed set to widen Diddy's sex probe over claims rapper bragged about shooting people, bribing jurors, and using J-Lo as a gun mule. I like our story better. Using J-Lo as a gun mule? I Apparently. What? I guess you had to move guns. I don't know. I haven't been reading and keeping up with the Diddy I, stuff. No, I haven't either. Yeah, so I don't I know. I don't know what's like. Yeah. I saw it like when it was on like breaking news that they went after and then he went out of town. I, I saw he was pacing. But mother effort left his country? kids, got in a plane, left his kids, got arrested. Dude is on a jet. I was like, I have to respect that. So he's not in the States, right? I don't I don't keep up with Diddy that much to know. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. Is his kids in the States still under? I don't know who handcuffs? his kid is. Who the F <laughs> leaves their kids? Ah, we, obviously, we don't have kids. I'm guessing a lot of people in the chat do. Would you leave your kids to get arrested? <laughs> Were you like, ooh, that's a whole I new mean, you're, you're, cold I life. mean, you're not getting arrested if you are not doing anything illegal. He left L.A. on a private jet. I know. Did Meanwhile, yeah, yeah. in L.A., yeah. his kids were in handcuffs at the mansion. I mean, they <laughs> that's fucking cold. They shouldn't do something illegal. Like they should. No, they were investigating him. Yeah, but why but were they searching? The, I guess when you search the home, you put him. You no, gotta you, put him. You don't put I don't him know. in handcuffs. You put like zip ties, maybe. What's the difference between handcuffs and zip ties? Does it matter? I don't know. They're apprehended and they're sitting there crying. An old boy how, is uh, how, sipping the crystal on the on the jet. How old are the kids? I'm thinking they're, they're like, adult kids. Oh, yeah. Huh. Maybe they were like in on it or something. I don't know. Again, I don't keep up with the Diddy news. All I the, the only kind of connection that I have with Diddy is that one time we had him on the Playhouse and the dude was just he and people always ask me this. They're like, "Who's the nicest and the meanest celebrity you've ever had to deal with?" Yeah, he's definitely the mean. The dude I had a say, guy. I wouldn't say mean, but he just was the dick, the worst. Yeah, the dude had a guy that he would look at, and the guy's sole job was to undo his water. Like it was a uh, just a water bottle. Yeah, like a the Sony water like, bottle. Right, you couldn't just go like that. The cap. Like, are you kidding me? Like, yeah. And then he wouldn't answer anything. I wonder if I can try to find that interview. I'm sure it's around here somewhere. Ah. Uh -huh. Yeah. I I don't know if I was a part of. Yeah, I don't. No, think that I, was before you. Yeah, I wasn't part of you guys yet. What about what's the other news that's happening this week? L Lizzo is out now. She says she quit. Yeah, Lizzo has quit the game. Allegedly, or she's gonna. I'm not losing sleep over it. Or she's gonna start. You know, you know, April Fools is Monday, so you don't know exactly uh, what you're reading. So I would also uh, like that's smart. Yeah, I'd give her respect if she pulls on one of those. She yeah. like releases an album. Yeah, like April Fools. Well, I think like Beyonce just released her album, the country album. I haven't listened to it yet, but I saw a lot like on Instagram. Like everyone's like, yeah, is know, it any good? The rate, what does the if, chat say? Yeah, if you give listened, me a review, drop me an instant voice note. You, yeah. Let me know. I'm going to sip on this. I was going to say, I got a text message. Um, what did it say? From Drew and Alex. Oh, Christ. Here we go again. <laughs> hey, our new song is out. Let me know what you think. <laughs> what is that? Are people really buy into that? What? Deron did. He was like, oh, Post Malone is texting you. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, but at least you have like a connection to where like you worked at a radio station. So maybe somehow. Yeah. But no, it's it's part of this thing. It's called like community. So it's like just a mass like text thing to like send yeah. out. They don't respond. Oh, uh, not them. Not country at all. Uh, but thank you, Beyonce. Uh, oh, 
Oh, no. She said, no, thank you. Oh, no, thank you, Beyonce. Ooh. Oh. Well, that no <laughs> yeah. really messes up that whole comment. Hold a whole different, like, <laughs> yeah. whole different vibe Meaning. before. Uh-huh. Uh. Mm-hmm. Mm. I want to play another game. Do you have okay, you want to do, uh, I was going to do match two. You want to do match two? Let's do it. All yeah. right, let's do it. Uh, we haven't done this in uh, in a while, so she's got to leave the room, and then I'm going to give you guys two words, and um, you're just going to type something in, you know? Just follow my lead. Get out. Oh. <laughs> the best oh, way to I describe how to get out. Yeah. What are we doing? Are we going to the? Oh Christ! Are we going to the eighteen-year-old party tonight? Is that what's happening? Oh. Sorry, I was just looking at my words, and then like right before the show started, she wants to go to like some rave, and I'm like, we're too old to be raving right now. Like, what are we doing? Let's get back to match two. So, I'm gonna give you a word. And I want you to think of, of of a word that you would give, right? Word association. And then I'm going to give you another word. And then once you have both of your answers, then drop them in the chat and no changing them. No changing them. We're going to see if anybody matches with Denise. And your first word is going to be ham. Let's go ham. H-A-M, ham, go. I'll give you a few minutes to think of a word. And let's do the, um, you know what? Let's go with... Only because I think that she's going to make a big deal out of this word. But Madonna was in town last night. Like a virgin is my jam. I'm old. Whatever. Let's go with virgin. Ham and virgin. There you go. Now that you guys have them, put both of them together. Drop them in the chat. None, none of y'all mother effers in the chat listen at all. I said you wait until you have both words. Jeez Louise, I can't go back and forth. That's never going to work. Come on, people. You can come in. Hey, is there uh, dropping the words in? Uh, don't look at the chat. Okay, let me close it. You sneaky, sneaky bee. I'm not sneaking. Uh, let me cover the chat. I can't. I yeah. close it. It's fine. Okay, let me. I just covered it up. So, um, but yeah, uh, are we doing the rave thing tonight, or what's happening? Oh my God, I would love to. Oh Christ! But to be honest, I don't have any money. <laughs> oh, thank God! <laughs> so probably not. I had to pay rent, even though we our lease is up. But yeah, I paid rent. Well, it's now. not like we're homeless. No, it's like she just hasn't asked us to re-sign a lease because yeah. she's, you know, she moved to Jordan. Yeah, Jordan. You yeah. know, whatever money you're paying is, uh, you know. Whew. What? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know where it's going, but <laughs> here we go. Um, two <laughs> words. That mean? Are you ready? <laughs> I'm so lost right now. PK, you are all over the place. Did you take your medication today? I did. That's frightening. You ready? Uh huh. Okay, your first word's gonna be ham. 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 That's the first word. Ham. Like Canadian bacon, ham, pineapple. H A M, ham. Is Canadian bacon and ham the same thing? Okay. I don't know. Oh, I think bacon is. Canadian bacon. Canadian like bacon is normal bacon in Canada. But to but be it's honest, circle, so what, they because they needed to figure no, out a different like, way. No, because when I get to, like a pepperoni pizza or like when I get a pineapple pizza, I was like, can I have like Canadian bacon and pineapple? That's not ham. That's pineapple. Uh, that's Canadian bacon, ham. It's ham and pineapple, right? Isn't that the same oh, thing? Oh yeah. Ask Surrey. Uh, well, no, no, because the the pineapple Canadian... pizza has that disgusting flesh-looking um, ham. ham. See, Canadian bacon. Huh. Why is it called Canadian? Is it from Canada? I okay, think, anyway, yeah. ham, so ham, ham, Cal has ham, to be ham. born there and have a passport. <laughs> do you want to give me a word for f and ham, or Easter. do you want to just uh... Easter? Because I, I, that's what oh. I told you that we're bringing for Easter is a ham. Because everyone has ham okay. on Easter, not Thanksgiving like you think. Ham, pig. Do not look pork. at the chat. I'm gonna uncover I'm it not, because I need to go to the cameras and it. stuff. All right. Ham. Cheating ass cheat. I'm not cheating. I think pig. <laughs> Pepper the pig. Uh, ham. The pig. Okay. I mean, obviously it's a pig. Ham. My first thing was Easter, but I think that's too personal because like for Easter, everyone always has ham. So Christ, I'm going to lock in night. pig. What? Uh, not one person said pig? Hold on. Hold what on. the hell? Let me go to the chat. Hold on. Somebody did say Easter. You should have stuck. Leslie said Easter. I don't know why you moved it from Easter. Easter was great. Tomorrow is Easter. Yeah. No one said pig for him. No. We got bone. We got cheese. We got sa sandwich. is really good. Pork. Pig sandwich? Pork is good, too. Um, Turkey. Pork and pig. Yeah. Isn't ha ham's sandwich. a pig? Yeah. Uh, no pigs. No pigs. Oh, Hold my God. Hold on. Let me get the man falling. <laughs> 
Jesus. Uh, well, this uh, this game's over, but uh, for fun, your oh. second word. Your second word for fun. You sucked so much, we didn't even get to the second part of this. Virgin. 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 Yeah. Like a virgin. Madonna, mm. who was just in town. Yeah. Um, But not a lot of people that are in Houston, they don't know that. I did mention that she was in town, oh, which okay. is why I picked the word, actually. Um. Oh. Margarita? Nancy, that's, that's a good one. Virgin Margarita. Virgin. Mary? <laughs> Look at me in for Mary. Yeah, yeah. Guys. Is that right? Guys, let me did go. Did I ahead. get one? No, no. I no was one talking said to, Mary? I'm, oh, wait. Uh, uh, did you, are you locking in I Mary? Locked or in are Mary. you asking? You I are. locked in Mary. Yeah, you okay, did. the you Virgin did get, Mary. Uh, you did sort of with. Uh, no um, one who said, said pig? Mary. Who? Why? Virgin Island? Uh, oh. Virgin Mary. Bradley. You matched with uh, Bradley. Yeah. Uh, Tiffany did say Madonna. Mm. Virgin Airlines. That's a great one, Maganzo. Oh, yeah. That's a great one. Mobile, Virgin. Yeah, it's a because they have like the the, yeah. the phone. Yeah. Um, I can't believe no one said pig. Is ham not a pig? I'm very lost. Why? Yeah, did it's the butt say, of the pig, isn't why it? Why didn't anyone say pig um, for ham? Uh, Dina, here you go. Damn it, Denise. Uh, Damn it, Denise. Damn it, Denise. Yeah, yeah. What is a ham? <laughs> it's the pig's butt. Everybody knows that. It's the salted leg. It is. It's pork. Okay, so oh. pork. I get it. Oh. Yeah, from the leg. Okay. Yeah. Whatever. Whatever. Uh, I, I thought I was doing okay. We were doing all right, but, yeah. uh, you I know. guess I don't want to play any more games. <laughs> uh, why does everyone eat ham on Easter? I didn't think that people did. I thought you yeah. were messing with me. No. Because he kept today. Ham is we're an Easter thing. We're going to go with thing. Ilya tomorrow to do, like, a little barbecue, right? He's going to grill because he's got a little rooftop area. And then she keeps telling me to go get a ham. And I'm like, the mother effort is grilling. And he doesn't really like ham. It's the traditional and Easter meat. And then she's meat. like, it's Easter. It's, yeah. You gotta get the ham. You gotta yeah. get the ham. Yeah. So we go to Kroger's. We don't get the fucking ham. Kroger's? Okay, Dorian. Because the bar's <laughs> closed, so we just leave. So no ham tomorrow. Yeah, no yeah. ham. Did you find out why it's, uh, did Jesus love the ham? What, what why is it a no, I said, thing? No, I said, what meat is traditionally eaten on Easter? And they said roasted lamb. And I was then like, I started thinking. I am. I'm like, no, that's Greek Easter. That's like Greek Orthodox. How about we rank the holidays of like food? our favorite ones? Because uh, like again, for unless food you, wise, no, just as a favorite holidays. Like as me, when she used to talk about Easter and the ham, I was like, oh, I kind of prefer Thanksgiving because then you get the turkey and everything, you know? Because okay, it's still says, a fat man in a skinny man's body now. What is the significance of ham on Easter? Yeah. Ham holds symbolic significance for many people during Easter as a rich, indulgent meat. It can represent the celebration of new life. At the end of Lenten season, during which many Christians abstain from certain luxuries. So, like, I think on, like, Fridays, no one eats actual meat. No, like, if you're, you I'll know, eat meat. I know you do. Oh, but. good. Last Friday. Fuckers. The, 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 par the parcel. How old am I? <laughs> the mail place. Mail, I had to mail some stuff. The and they were like, sorry, post. we're closed early because it's good Friday. I'm yeah. like, what the F? <laughs> the F? <laughs> God. You are one. Are you going to one. church? Why are you closing early on a fucking Friday? Because it's you're good not, Friday. Unless you're it's going part... to church, I don't want to hear it. Uh-huh. Anyway, uh, what was I saying? I don't have any idea. Um, yeah, when it comes to holidays, 4th of July is up there. I actually really like Christmas. Thanksgiving, really like Thanksgiving. Yeah, and th th those are like really, Halloween is a great one. Holiday is more of like the end of the year thing, you know? It's like. What yeah, about like, a, a birthday? Uh, That's my favorite holiday. Uh, your birthday. Your birthday. Oh, yeah. Oh, but this is what I wanted to... Another um, candle on the cake. Make a, a, a little bet with the chat as well, and everybody, the replay gang, 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 gang. Uh, the last time I talked to my father was on January 27th. Some of y'all might know the significance of that date. It Two is my birthday. Two months ago? It is my birthday. Why haven't you guys so, But spoke? he always calls on Easter, and I, I want to remind the man that... You're a Colombian drug lord, but Easter is, you know, like you still no, go to church at midnight. He, so will he call? Because he, he always no, calls. No, he won't call. On, He'll he, call. He only calls for Greek. Yeah, but it's the it, same it, day this no, year. No, it's not. It's, it's not? Uh, you told me it was in May. No, Greek, you told me it was the same day. I don't know. what. Greek, how do I know where it is? Greek Orthodox Easter. In 20, I, thought I don't know. It was like May something. Yeah, it's May 5th. It's on Single to Mile. You, you know what we should do is go to uh, Olstein's place. I bet you it's... Oh, popping tonight oh, oh. or uh was it tonight or no because it's uh, midnight well, right i bet you tonight they got like lasers and shit <laughs> yeah <laughs> fucking like you want to see a concert i fucking got so you. yeah your dad will not call you tonight he will call you in may you don't think he'll oh uh, yeah because yeah yeah i mean you're greek remember he's that all right though it's uh, weird he's I, gotten, gotten this long without calling it's almost to the point that like i don't want to call him because it's like now kind of uh who's gonna break first call it's your like dad playing chicken call your parents 
When was I, the last time you called your parents? <laughs> like earlier this afternoon. Talked to him for 25 minutes. What did I ask? Let's see what Shay <laughs> yeah. said. Uh, great job with your running, Shay. I've been uh, following you on the uh, uh, Twitter, and I see you in Discord. Y'all join Discord. Discord's fun. I uh, pop in there from time to time, especially when I drop the the plus shows. Like yeah. I always go to Discord. I'm like, hey, this and that, it, it's you know. Here. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and I love the fact that uh, you know, you get some instant voice notes from that. So anyway, uh, Shay saying, uh, speaking Fourth of July, if I register you and Denise, no. Oh, no. you're very sweet, Shay. No. But did you register before a run? What are you thinking? I was like, July Fourth is. Yeah. Uh, picture just because we always go back with Uncle Jerry and Mern too. Yeah. Yeah. The carnage that is yeah. Yahats, Oregon. Fourth of where July. Last year, the guy took the circular saw right through his leg yeah. with like, I don't know, a group of 10 year olds. Oh my God! Uh -huh. Blood squirting. Uh -huh. Oh, it's great. Helicopter, med helicopter coming in. You could hear it in the day. It was crazy. It was yeah. great. I was like, Can't this, this tiny yeah. town of like, I, I said 300 people. I don't know how many residents are in Yahats, but like that's been our thing for what, 15? Yeah. No longer. Like before we got married. No, when we got married, I think we started. How about going. the fact that these Fs kept the chicken recipe? They would do this chicken. It was so great. 706 people, my bad. It took me seven years to get this recipe. I had to wait seven years and the recipe was like something I could just look up. Oh, and the mother effort. And they no longer carry the sauce. And then, yeah, and then <laughs> the lady that created the sauce that makes this recipe done. fucking just decided, oh, I'm she done making sauce. She retired. She's well, I waited it. seven years. Yeah. No chicken recipes. Like, come on. Yeah. Anyway, anything else? We should probably start wrapping it up. Yeah. Uh, I think it's been an hour. It, it has been. Um, how, how are things with you, though? Like, you got any, like, life updates that you oh, want to share uh, with the No, I don't have any life updates. Tony's still stringing me along, so, you know, okay. we'll see what happens with that. Uh, looking at my notes, uh, we've talked about Brewery Boy. Yeah. Um, oh, I did want to say this, too. I was thinking about... It, it's very hard because, like, um, uh, I kind of do want to start dropping, like, plus shows uh, daily. Not Nothing, like, crazy, but, like, 10, 15 minutes. Maybe we'll talk about the new story of the day or something, just or just <laughs> my complaining or something, you know. But then... Uh, but then I want to invest that time into actually trying to get a job to pay for things. Mm -hmm. So it's a lot of back and forth. But I'm telling you all this just to also let you know that I'm thinking about, because there's been so many crazy stories on the show, especially with like the Darian uh, years and stuff, you know, like of having people submit their favorite moment, like not even moments, like stories, things that actually happen to whether it was the watermelon or Darian's yeah. like circumcision at 12 or uh, like... No, uh, not his personal... Well, uh, the, the, the one the, he the did. The 12, right? Yeah, but the one 15. that Darian actually did. Um, I want to give some love real quick. It Mama, starts I'm in the middle with, of the it, sentence! It starts with an E. He said, what did I miss? As we just said we were wrapping up. Oh, uh, we were going to get married. Me and you, Ilya, you and I. And then, uh, <laughs> then we decided that if we did... <laughs> leave our girls and got together it would be great but then we'd break up if we went to a chicken place as what i said so we've already been married and divorced I, that's what i said i said Ilya, you missed that pk wanted to marry you but then he decided to divorce you <laughs> uh baby dexter yeah that's what i'm talking so anyway what i yeah, was yeah, thinking yeah. is about like taking the the best stories and i would need people's help of like things that really stick out in their memories you know and plucking those in like uh every day or every other day i drop one of those you know okay. and i'll like oh talk in the beginning like setting it up or whatever and then that way we have like a catalog of yeah. like those great moments because there's been so many hours and hours of the show that i'm afraid that a lot of those great moments will just kind of yeah you know just go out there. so i don't know i'm debating gone. it i'm thinking about it if you got a plus pk and dk uh, dk plus membership let me know what you think because you are I the ones that would uh, listen to that yes i actually think that that would be entertaining because like we listen back to it and then can also like give our feedback so it's like a little like back in the day remember oh, no, you're story? not gonna be a part of it Fuck. You're right. They're actually working. This is what I would do like during the day. I, I, Whoa, I this is forget. oh, it's all about me. I forget. I'm taking off the headphones. Why? Uh, we're not going to the the. I'm not. I really don't want. To, really? What? 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 What's the plan for this evening? Oh, this. Okay. <laughs> not at the the. The last time she took me to Stereo Live is the place called. Again, I like, don't have any money, so no. Okay. <laughs> I can't afford to go. Well, the way that you were saying it earlier made me believe that you really wanted to go. Of and then I thought I, I was go. like, for a minute you had me because I'm like, oh, I love this band. And then I found out it's a DJ. I'm like, I'm not fucking going back there. Yeah. It's like the last time I was the oldest person in the in the building. Nobody's wearing any clothes. I just felt so out of place. And, you know, and it, also, this is the DJ. Like, I, if it was a band, different story. Different story. Why didn't we go to Madonna? Because of the money situation? Yeah. Would you have gone if we had yeah. tickets? I love any. You don't music. like Madonna. I love Fuck yes, out of here. Oliver. Vogue. Vogue okay, name Vogue, another song. Vogue. Virgin. Okay, that's not a name of a song, but all right, I'll I'll even give you that one. Go. <laughs> 
Oh, fuck it, number one Madonna fan right here. I never said that, but I I love live music no matter what. Well, not the Satanic Bar. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> let's one. go there tonight. <laughs> that shit will be real cheap. Satanic <laughs> Bar. $10. Uh, guys, X will be up there yeah. and the dude spilling, what is he spilling on himself? Candle wax? wax? Yeah. Who does he, that? He like put wax in his mouth and then wax on people. Yeah, Elia's right. Madonna's gross now. That's exactly yeah, but, dude, but, but, that's what, what, exactly what I told but, Denise. I'm like, I love her music from like back in the day. And that's what it was. It was like, like an Eras nasty. tour almost. Like, yeah. it, it, you know, it encompassed all of I, think, I mean, what I hear, I obviously didn't. It's go. a simple thing. It's like you just have to embrace your age. Yeah. And I say that uh, because today I thought I was forty-seven. Uh, I did some math in the car, and I'm like, "Holy fuck! I just got a whole year." <laughs> PK's like, I've "Wait, been, are we in an I've odd been, or an even year?" I'm like, "We're 2024." He goes, "Oh, I gained a year back." I'm like, "Oh my dude, god!" Have you ridiculous. ever? I just got a fucking year, <laughs> like magic, like poof. <laughs> it's like holy shit! Now I felt like so much younger, and like I was like, "Oh yeah." <laughs> I was like driving, like a little pep in my step. I was oh. so excited. Aww. So excited because I was down. I was like, oh, 47. I don't even know how that came up uh, that we were talking about 47. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> or why I even brought it up here. There was a tie-in, but now I forgot the tie-in. Uh, oh, because Madonna. That's what I was going to say. It's like you just have to own kind of your age or the, your age bracket at the very least. Like, yeah. you know, if you start acting like you're 15 and you're obviously, you know, 46 or something. Yeah. It's just, uh, you know. But I'm. It's just. Uh, not a well, eh. but what? but aren't aren't we also to the point where we said like no matter what like embrace yourself like if she that looks is, like a fucking lizard oh, well, she okay li so she, i don't know you want to embrace a, that fine is she a lizard person somebody's got to be Who in her circle that says like what the fuck are you doing that's the problem you get that much money nobody's in there to be like nobody has like an Elia that will tell me yeah you know, but I I also thought that we had embraced like being who you are as a person. So if you want to walk around in a like song, a plastic container, I guess, yeah, uh, like a plastic. Container. I know, but then you're invading. If you want to be a cat, oh, yeah, you, you could be. A cat. I thought like we were there, like we had this discussion, like you know, everybody can be who they want to be as long as you're not like doing anything illegal. But I think we've lost a step because there's there's nobody. It, it, you're right; they're not doing anything illegal, and you're a hundred. And if she's confident, that's what she wants to be, and people want to pay, and like she's been around for decades. Yeah, like, yeah. Like, was it sold out? It probably was. Huh? Oh, for sure. For How much was tickets going for? I didn't look. Huh. Yeah, I didn't look. Lizard lady bringing in the dough. Who? Let me was let me applaud about? that. Let me applaud that, Lisa. I was gonna call your. I yeah. was gonna call Lisa to get a review, but yeah. I don't know. Like yeah, you know, I don't, I don't know. If she'll answer, but give her. Yeah, she she is a diehard Madonna fan. She was I want to like, ask her if she looked like she like took pictures of she looked like uh know, with her like CDs and glad. Yeah. I, I feel like almost. What's that? I mean, I wouldn't say like she's my Britney because like Britney, you know, she made out with Britney. Oh Jesus Christ! You let Britney go. I can't. Why not? I want to be Brittany. Now, I'm calling Lisa. She's going to think that there's like an emergency because I'm calling her. <laughs> or she's going to think that like, uh, you know. The right Lisa or are you going to call her. the wrong Lisa? I again? don't know. I'm such an idiot. <laughs> I was awful earlier. Surprised I even have friends. <laughs> really am. And I'm surprised everyone like loves you so much. <sighs> oh, Do I they? don't know. Mm, mm. Yeah. That's it's okay. Debatable. I think we're going to get I think a, there's a few people that don't. I think we're going to get a voicemail. Ah, uh, the phone number? Please leave me a detail. Ah, uh, detailed message. That's so professional. Ah, uh, well, I mean, it's a perfect yeah. number on there. Yeah, let me turn that down. Make sure I turn that down before every, all y'all start calling her, and then there's... I wanted to... What are you... Oh, what are I, you, I, I was going to say I wanted to give you a call. You don't have to explain why I called her. Just leave her a mystery. Maybe she'll be like, oh, he's trying to hit on me. Oh, my God, no. Leave it in mystery. Oh, here she is. Oh, <laughs> Hey, we're doing the podcast, and I wanted to... <laughs> Hi! Want to, Hi, Lisa! Hello! Happy Hello. anniversary! Aw, thank you! I wanted, to, I wanted to ask you about Madonna. How was Madonna, and did, uh, you know, how was the show? Madonna was amazing. Yeah. She is so iconic. I We all dressed up. Well, I did, obviously. <laughs> um. <laughs> you look so hot. I, you look so good. I was very channeling my 13-year-old, 15-year-old self, you know, with all things. Like, no, she was she was amazing. I mean, the woman's 65. Yeah. And literally, like, It looks like a Tupperware all. container. Okay. <laughs> how did she? How did she look? PK? How did she look? Why? Nice. Why? You know, I'm not. She's she got bangers. Fit. I love her music. <laughs> she is fit. I will say she was around that whole stage like she was like 20. Insane. I mean, getting up close, you know, she's looking a little uh, 
you know, she's had some work done, obviously, but I mean, she, <laughs> but no, it was amazing. Did she it do was a, absolutely amazing. She did everything, right? You got to do everything. Cause it's she, not like, you, oh, know, yeah. you don't know at that oh. age, if you're going to come back around, you got to do like, Oh no, right? she, no, she was amazing. Like erotica. She played Vogue. She oh, just, yeah, my books, like pop it, don't preach all, oh. of the so, all the things. It was amazing. I'm so glad we went. I'm so glad I was like, cause otherwise I'd have been pissed off, like for not buying uh, a ticket and going, but she was epic. Yeah. It was fabulous. Yes. How are y'all doing on the show tonight? Hey, we're good. We're good. <laughs> good. I mean, I'd been better if Denise took me to McDonald's. Oh last night, but nope. yeah. uh, you know? Why, well, maybe you have to go. Uh, she wants to take me to, next. She wants to take me to some stereo live show tonight. I'm like, Oh, yeah, great. I no, see no I don't want to see Robin Schultz. Let's oh my go. God. What oh my time? God. <laughs> thank you. At Fucking thank oh you. I'm too old to be making oh plans at 10 30 at night. Well, this is home at like two o'clock last night i'm like dying today i'm like oh my god i'm so old <laughs> like and there's madonna prancing around on the stage at 65 yeah what was the crowd like you know, city to w city is it just like old people in the crowd or not older oh, people in the crowd or old people Jesus. like me Jesus. Jesus. <laughs> okay. Like, okay. i phrased that wrong up, <laughs> old people that dressed wrong. up like they're madonna in the 80s basically oh. yes mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> i can't with you <laughs> like, it was, a, it was a, you know what's really funny though i bumped into like a bunch of people i <laughs> like, uh, so obviously, we, <laughs> it was awesome. I was like, oh yes, and we're all dressed up like crazy people. It's amazing. Oh, yeah. oh, I love that for no, you. It so was a, it was a range. Yeah. It was definitely a range. Like um, there was like these two younger girls in me, and we were like all matching. I was like, okay. She's like, we'll take a photo. I'm like, love it. <laughs> what do you mean you were matching? Like, is it the same well, dress or something, or did you have well, like a? We're all looking like Madonna, and it was basically like Madonna, but with like the black fish net fish. Um, fishnet stockings and like with the black cap and like the whole like the cross and like all the things like the lace and the gloves like yeah. just very madonna in the 80s so it was hilarious like we all there's one photo denise you'll have to oh, show yeah, it yeah yeah oh, like there's like these I random girls yeah, yeah. and they were just like oh, yeah let's take a photo i was like wow we that's a very exactly. provocative outfit there lisa it's very, it is <laughs> wow. it is i was bringing it i mean it's madonna after all and boy was she very provocative on the stage i was like yes love it wait she still <laughs> is provocative on the stage oh yeah she, she was provocative on the stage my my literally like jaw to the floor i was like yes this is what i came for gotta be awkward for the this kids right this is what i came for no kids well, are going well, there. her kids oh, oh yeah you know, oh, hey, mom, she, had her, show? she had and it's true she had her her daughter was there performing oh yeah she incorporates her kids and everything uh, is like, the oh daughter gosh, any good imagine? or is it just like all right my mom's madonna so i'm gonna i get feel pass. like that's it oh, i feel like that's yeah. exactly that sucks that. i mean i'm sucks. sorry like you know i mean <laughs> i'm sure she's great but i was there to see madonna not her child yeah, <laughs> yeah. i'm just saying stage. i was like uh, how many songs exactly can we have some more of your crazy mom oh, thanks oh, wait, so much you know what time did the show start um she pref she got on at 10 30. Oh, oh that, my God. that's when Denise so we just were, starts making plans. <laughs> oh, well, exactly. Apparently. I mean, we're going to bed now. Like it's 8.15. I'm like, oh my God, I'm like in bed. I'm like, my feet hurt. I'm like all like bruised up and everything. Like, okay, we gotta get How was tonight. like a prayer? That's my, that's probably yeah. my oh, favorite. Yeah, yep. They played it amazing. Of course. Aww. I mean, it, it, it was phenomenal. I mean, seriously. Like, who else everything is on your bucket played. list? Who, who else is like at that caliber that you're like, oh man, I have to see them if they ever tour or come around here or is there anybody well, they're else? they're dead now. They're dead now. Amy Winehouse? She's dead. She's dead. Yes. You it's can't so just sad. Always I mean, go to Amy Winehouse. I mean, well, you know, I mean, seriously, out of like, I mean, I've already seen the Stones, right? Uh, and the Stones because my parents, because my, well, because my parents met at a Stones concert. So I can't, you know, yeah, love yeah, the Stones. Yeah. I got to, got to, you know, but uh, I mean, Madonna for sure. She's legendary, as is Amy. But, you know, I don't know. I think those are the most impactful. I mean, of course, Madonna as a child, like a, well, a teenager in the, in the 90s and you're, you know, just the the empowerment she has as individuality and just being so like sensual and sexual and all the good things. But yeah, yeah I think I think she was on my on my bucket list. You know, I've already seen Michael Jackson, so that's already done. And you know, he's gone too, Aww. which is very sad. Yeah. I know. That so was I, on I, my bucket list uh, is uh, Michael Jackson, it? and it just it didn't yeah. happen. Yeah. 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 Oh, well, you'll have a great night. Are you going to go out to the little, uh, <laughs> where is this does, place? Does, I mean, does, does I mean, it sound like a good night? It's like the most random. Stereo life. Does it sound like a good night? No, I will no. not be having Wait, a good who night. Who said that 
you told what? me you went to Stereo Live when you were like uh, younger. Yeah, <laughs> no shit. Everybody <laughs> is there this like, oh, like a rave, like this rave place. Yeah, she <laughs> wants to go to her. I thought it was a band, so I was halfway you know, in earlier. I'm like, oh, cool. I'm, I'm, I like I'm this pretty band. Sure. DJ. Yeah, I mean, I can't really say I dressed up last night, like, <laughs> <laughs> and I went out till two, so I feel like you know, go go for it. Boss go for, okay, boss. There we right. go. Thanks for the encouragement. <laughs> this is <laughs> not what I needed. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to bed then. So <laughs> <laughs> cheers to that. Cheers to that. Uh, Thank you so right. much. Thanks Y'all for jumping on. Right. You, you too. Bye. Okay. Bye. Bye. Uh, yeah, I would have totally gone to, uh, you know. Yeah. She's actually, she was on one of my lists of like people that I needed to see. But uh, I think ticket prices was like, yeah. Yeah. I don't see her that bad. Uh, I'm cool. I know. Yeah. I know. All it's, right. It's tough. Uh, uh, Mimi, Lord Nelly. Oh, we got up. Mysterious Dave oh, joining the Oh, Dave finally fucking showed up, huh? <laughs> I, wonder if, I, I wonder if we weren't like specific because like it's eight now? I say central. And, That's what the CSD kinda, stands like, for. Everyone's like joining now, like a little bit into it. Well, I don't know what to tell them. Uh, Mimi, Lord Nelly, so used to being part of the replay gang and gang. I forgot it was live. Yeah, we're live. We're here. Thanks for uh, being yeah. part of the replay gang, Mimi, Lord. No, Mimi, Lord Nelly. Or is it meme? It Meme, might. Lord, N- oh, MLN. Uh, uh, MLN. <laughs> <laughs> we we needed to get a quick call with uh, Josh and Jilly about. Oh, yeah. Do you have to call? Nickelback. You never know, though. You get Josh on. That's like a whole thing. <laughs> what do you mean, a whole thing? Well, I just never know. <laughs> it's, oh, he's still counting. Yeah, you got to ask him. He might still be you, at the Nickelback thing. You got to ask him how many corks he's got. Apparently, the. <laughs> he's going to get all pissy. No, uh, the, the Twift Stoth uh, caps are now. A they part don't of it. count. They yeah, do not count. You got to tell him that. You got to be you kidding gotta me. You got to tell him The that. motherfucker <laughs> is counting the Twist Off wine top? Yeah, no. Yeah, yeah. Nobody counts that. Well, that's the thing. <sighs> Fucking Josh. Yeah. Are you calling? <laughs> I got you know what I, what I love about him is like I got him in my phone a skinny Josh because yeah. he's on the uh Mongerno. You guys yeah, are yeah. Mo Bros. But I th- oh you're calling skinny? Yeah, that's my <laughs> I thought skinny. it was silly. Who the fuck counts the like yeah, twisty the twisty metal parts? Yeah. Uh. Silent. Oh, well, I don't know. They probably no, had just... a wild day because they did that <laughs> show at three p.m. <laughs> Now they're probably have passed out by now. We just sit in silence. I asked them if there was a that. bar at the uh, theater. Yeah. Because well, I'm like, if you're going to a three o'clock show, there's got to be a bar. Your call has been forwarded uh, to voicemail. Yeah. All right. The call, person you're trying to reach silly. is not available. At- uh, well, don't you think that if he's not answering, that he probably doesn't want to talk? Maybe he's in the shower. Who the fuck takes a shower eight o'clock on a Saturday? I mean, I, I haven't sh- taken a shower in three days. Me either. Oh. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> You have a job, so you have no excuses. Uh, Albert also joining us. Albert, what's up, man? Just found my phone and tuning in. Where? What was it lost? <laughs> like, uh, how do you just find your cell phone? That's Dude. interesting. Where was Where it? Where was it? Yeah, was how about it about the like, fact under that the couch? Oh my god! What? The key. <gasps> oh my god! I'm so embarrassed. Oh no. Maybe they're smashing. Oh, I mean. Yeah. Possibly. I'll just leave this here. If they call, they call. Um, this Denise has been going off <laughs> on me for no lie two effing months. Two months. About correct. how dumb I am. Yeah. I can't believe you lost the car key. Now we only have one. You can't lose this one. Uh-huh. How many times do I have to tell you, PK, to put things where they belong? Yes. When you come in, you hang them up. Yes. This is what happens when you don't do that. Blah, 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 blah. Meanwhile, I'm like, how did I F did I lose this key? And I've P- gone through all my pockets. Yep. And then PK's like, I, I, I went through the car, I went through here, there, 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 there. And then today, I don't know why I decided to put on like my denim jacket today, but I was like, oh, it kind of looks cute or something. And I, <laughs> I'm like, God, it's kind of heavy on one side. <laughs> she comes out. It's heavy on one side. Like, I was like, what the hell is in here? It feels like my phone is in here. And I go in, I'm like, fuck. <laughs> Ezra just joined the chat. Watch your oh, fucking language. Oh, sorry, sorry. Hi, Ezra. Christ. Oh, sorry. Oh, On the Lord's I, oh, Day. Oh, God. I said. Filthy mouth. I hope. said, oh, Fruit Loops. <laughs> she comes out and she's like, oh, look what I found in my pocket. <laughs> uh, I'm like, whoa, two months of you going off on me. And that's the apology that. Two months. Aww. That's the apology that yeah. I get. So I didn't know how. Because again, I totally blamed him. And I was like, I don't know how to go about this. Do I just like hang it up? Do I just be like... Am I that clueless that you think that would have just been like, oh, it's been hanging out on the hook the entire two months? Yes. (laughs) I don't know whether to take offense to that. (laughs) So we found it. 
it. <laughs> Apology accepted. Yeah. All right. Uh, let's wrap things up. Uh, all right. Have an awesome. Uh, so we're back on Wednesday. Is that the deal? Correct. Yeah. Wednesday. Um. So our official podcast anniversary, if you will, is Monday because it's April 1st and we started back in 2014. So this coming Wednesday, because like we started with Wine Wednesday and everything, like I kind of want to do a big fun party, maybe balloons. It's champagne. a Wednesday. Okay. <laughs> okay, I'm just saying that, like, you know, if you want to do that, probably tonight would have been a good day for that instead of a Wednesday, but... What does it matter to you? Okay. What are you doing on Thursday? You're so busy. Wow. <laughs> that was cold. Respect. I have to give you... Uh, give you applause for that one. That was good. Uh, all right, so Wednesday we'll do the 10-year thing. I was thinking maybe I'll go back to some of the, uh, like, the first... Oh, my have gosh. Have you ever watched the very first episode oh that we ever did? Oh, my God, no. I wonder how bad I'm, it is. I'm a little probably has not... nervous, actually. What if it's better than what we're doing now? <laughs> I mean, probably. I, probably. I, I just think that it's really, like, I don't know. It's been a crazy ride, like, the last 10 years since, um, like, we started the show, and then we got picked up in Atlanta, and then the job ended, and then we came here, and we're still continuing to do this, and all of you guys that always, like, support... Like, I don't know. It's It's been incredible. It's an incredible journey to see us, like, for the last 10 years, like, document through our life and, like, yeah. changes and, like, the really hard stuff, the really fun stuff. But honestly, like, this is my therapy, being able to talk to everyone, communicate, having everybody join in together and just, like, ever ending story. Is that what you're playing? Right no, now? I haven't <laughs> played that. Plus, I don't want YouTube to, like, you know, take yeah. the, you know, no. Yeah. No, uh, that's why I wanted to do uh, for the plus people is like pull some of the stories that yeah. um, because it's been, you know, even the drive to Atlanta when I'm like, uh, you know, oh I don't want to tell you what city we're moving to, yeah. uh, but we're going to this uh, brewery at Piedmont Park. <laughs> like, idiot. Oh, my God. You guys and, like, were everybody so, knew you guys were so like, yeah. oh, like, you know, you guys are in Atlanta or like I took a picture. It was like St. Patrick's Day or something. And I like I took a picture of a beer green beer and like the coaster said like yeah. Piedmont and then people are like oh, is there well, in obviously. Atlanta? And I was like oh shit. And we couldn't say where <laughs> we were going for whatever reason. I don't know why. Like everybody knew we were moving there. Yeah. But they didn't want the word to get out to who. I don't know. You know. Uh, but uh, yeah. So I don't know. There's a lot of moments that have happened. So if you've got something uh, hit me up. Let me know. Hello at pkdk.com or drop me uh, an instant voice note and then I'll start plucking those and then Oh, you know, again, that could be just something else that we can drop like throughout the week because I yeah. want to start dropping some stuff, uh, you know. God, I can't believe like yeah. our, our little shows from like 10 years ago where we had the Kiki cam. Remember? Oh, Kiki's yeah, always yeah, had yeah. a cam. And now she's dead. Mm, you want me to draw a picture? She wanted another you? dog today. I'm I like, do, oh, you out of yeah. your mind? Yeah. Why am I out of my mind? I'd much rather have another dog than like, you know, child at the moment. Wow. Let's get. PK's next chapter of his career figured out before we bring in another I'm home, baby. human being. I'm at the house. I, can I take know, care but of that let, I understand that. But on my salary, we cannot afford well, to. Well, you got to work harder. I, I work Roll up them sleeves. A lot. Let's get, it. get at it. <laughs> what about the guesses for what's that noise? Oh, what's that noise? In yeah. the chat. Oh, in the chat is uh, what No, asking. you got to drop us instant voice notes for that. Got to drop us instant voice Wait, notes. We can do live instant voice notes, though, if people want to do that. I said that at the beginning of the show. Now the show's over, so no. Oh, I PK. mean, yes. Yes, we can. We, we, we can still have five minutes if people want to leave an instant voice note. Like, let's end it, because we used to do it twice during the show. So one more time. What's that noise? All right. When did I say drop it in the chat? Did I really say drop it in the chat? Probably. I don't know what I'm saying half the time. Listeners know more than you do. Yes. I got to pull the, the Ben clip from earlier today. Like, Jesus Christ. I'm such an idiot. <laughs> I can't get over the fact of how dumb I am sometimes. <laughs> uh, love you guys. Thank you so much. Thanks for listening to uh, or, and watching and joining us live and uh, the replay gang, 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 and my, my plus people as well. Appreciate you. You good? Anything else? Uh, I mean. What, you want to just keep the show going? Like what, what's happening over there? I'm just saying that you said to drop it in the chat. Everyone had all these guesses in the chat. So you kind of okay, have to like, the people got to be heard. Uh, what I see is PK being a stay at home dad. That's not a guess for mm -hmm. what's that noise. You said drop it in the chat. Okay. Yeah. Uh, PK typing on a computer or laptop. I'll give you that. <laughs> that is incredible. That's a pretty good guess. Yeah. No, I don't know. Is it? Does it sound like. Oh, okay. You know what? I can hear that. Yeah, that is a good guess. Yeah. So again, this was a sound we recorded. The noise was recorded in Hawaii. Yeah, so I wouldn't be on a laptop. Well, sometimes I'm on a laptop You're out there. You're always on your yeah, laptop. Yeah, yeah. Oh, by the way, PK has a new title to add to his signature line of his emails. Why Why would you bring this up? I knew you were going to bring this up. <laughs> 
So we were chatting and uh, pole man and wifey and very cute little baby of 18 months decided to go take like what? Blue bonnet pictures? And yeah, they wanted uh, blue bonnet pictures. Yeah, because yeah, yeah. that's a huge so thing So I in told Texas, him, I was like, you've got to do it sunrise or sunset to get the beautiful colors. Yeah. It's going to be perfect. So this dude says, okay, let's do it tomorrow at I, 11, uh, 11 a.m. I thought he said 10. Uh, 10, yeah. yeah. I'm like, that's not sunrise or sunset, bro. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But how'd they turn out? Or, or no, no, no. What I was saying is like, PK was like sharing the story. He goes, yeah, I was with another professional photographer. And I, I like, meant Pump that. Pump the brakes. Hold on. You're with another professional. I'm like, so that means that you are a professional photographer? I was like, oh, sweetheart. That's so cute. <laughs> so apparently, add it to the signature line, professional photographer. Then PK quickly corrected me. He said, cinematographer. I'm like, mm hmm, sure. Okay. What Let's I meant to say is that I was there to take pictures, <laughs> yeah. right? And uh, there was another family that was there. With an obvious professional photographer. Uh -huh. Another. <laughs> uh, that came out wrong, obviously. Uh. Oh, I just thought that was really, I mean, and, and you are, you're so great at like your. You just got done shitting on me about I'm, like, but, oh. Of course I have to give you a hard time. When okay. else do I ever get to give you a hard time? Don't answer. Yeah. There's kids watching. And then, that, and then uh, you know, um, I mean. They were very nice, and you know, kept thanking me and stuff. I'm like, don't thank me yet, because like, what if these pictures don't look good? Yeah. Like, let me send you the pictures you, of what I have. But like, so, when was the last time like you ever created something that was bad? Uh, I don't know if you ever heard the show in Atlanta. <laughs> <laughs> the one that I was a part of. Oh yeah, shit! I should have used I the totally Houston one. Have two oh man, I'm off my game tonight. And again, we have kids watching, but you see this one. Yeah, yeah, I do. Mm -hmm. Probably they do too. Oh. Uh, we good? good okay anything Thank else you so sure yeah oh my god you you, oh, you shouldn't have shown that what the finger you shouldn't have put it up in the air <laughs> raindrops hitting the window oh that's a freaking Wait, amazing that guess that again. amazing guess That's probably, I don't want to say the closest guess. Yeah. It's, it's, that's a really good guess. It's around, like you're getting yeah. very warm. We'll very just, warm. Yeah, we'll leave it at that. Oh no. Ace, that's not my name. Uh, we all saw it. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. yeah no, yeah. what she wrote. Oh, wait. Uh, Ace Gilmore. That, that, that I'm not, no, we gotta oh, go. Oh, yeah. Well, how about the, the, the stupid boil house? You, they paid you on the thing. I'm like, how do you mess up PK? It's two effing letters. <laughs> like, I'm mean, so uh, just dumb. So I'm sitting there, and I'm like, huh. It usually, is, they're really quick about getting the crawfish, you know? Yeah. It's a place okay, this, Boyle is, House, this, yeah? this is a restaurant. Yeah, they're known best place in Houston to get crawfish, by the way. It's total, like, Louisiana style. P-Cat. Order for P-Cat. <laughs> P-Cat? Oh, you got to be kidding me. This is the second time you've been called P-Cat. P-Cat. So I go up there. It's, literally, it's on the bag. Literally, the letter P and then the capital C-A-T. P-Cat. P-K. There's two letters. How do you mess that up? <laughs> They're lucky they got good crawfish. And then the guy today was yeah. like a little too close to me. I'm like, dude, you have like two seats. Why are you so close to me? Well, next some, to I need you, some you... elbow room. Oh, you're you... eating crawfish. There's juices and stuff going everywhere. Okay. You have a little elbow room. Everybody else. What are you doing? It was content. You... And then he had the weird move that he got it in the drive-thru and then yeah. parked the car and then ate it. I'm like, dude, if you're going to eat here, just order it inside the restaurant. I don't, yeah. I don't know. He did... I thought we decided that he was like, it's a nice day. I'm going to sit outside well, and like hang out with people. Yeah. He also had a great move. He brought his own gloves. Did yeah, I thought that? that was weird too. Why? You don't want to get yeah, crawfish stuff like under your nails? I'm like, Have you washed your what hands are you, a since hand you model? even ate crawfish today, by the way? What happened? Have you washed your hands since you ate crawfish earlier? I have not. Because I like the smell of it, and then also the dog licks me. Oh loves me even more. Oh my God, you're just So I have not. Disgusting. How about the one lady that we sit down and she comes over and <laughs> takes the paper towels? <laughs> I'm like, yo, we're eating too. You can't just take, go inside and get the paper towels. <laughs> she sat inside. Uh, okay, well, right. on that note. This is what happens during the day here. Yeah, we're so entertaining. <laughs> yeah, this is what happens Saturday night. Have an awesome uh, weekend, guys, and then uh, we'll be back on Wednesday. Until then.
Bye. Bye. It's the PK and BK Show. Catch us live weekdays at 5 Pacific, 7 Central, 7 Central, or at pkandk.com. With replays, podcasts, blogs, and more. I actually leave, and I'm not, I'm not going to say it again. Bye. 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 Bye.